Hi loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, I finally tried the mini braids. This is my first time trying mini braids and I really love the results I must say. So, um, I started on freshly washed hair and I did stretch my hair. I blow dried my hair and if you want to do this style i think there are some points some things you have to take into consideration before getting this done so i think the first point would be to make sure you start on freshly washed hair just like with any size hairstyle i mean it's common sense you have to start with freshly washed hair and i think a plus would be to blow dry your hair because it's going to be easier and it's going to look way neater I, I don't know if you get my point but yeah you can either blow dry your hair or use the african threading method either way anyone is fine just make sure if you use heat use a heat protectant and the second point is when you do your your braids don't leave the ends exposed if you get to the tight the tip like the tip of your hair you can actually twist that up like i did you're going to see that in a minute yeah make sure you twist your ends and uh, so that you will be able to maintain moisture because it can easily dry out i think that is like a very very good point so I like this style because it gives um, access to your scalp you know there are some hairstyles that you might not necessarily have access to your scalp but not this one this style actually gives you access to your scalp and um, yeah to apply your products like to all your scalp and you do your scalp massages if that's your thing Another reason why I love this hairstyle is because you can wash and condition your hair even though it's in a protective style. I mean, I mean, plus the fact that you can have access to your scalp. If you work out as well, which is like a plus, if you work out, you don't even have to bother about sweating because you can literally wash and like deep condition your hair in a protective style. Which is not common with other hairstyles or styles that involve extensions. It, it might be common but yeah. I think doing mini braids like this it's, it's definitely going to be better. And if you work out and you sweat you can easily wash your hair. And another thing I love about mini braids is that you can easily apply your hair products. You can easily moisturize your hair at any time. You can literally moisturize your hair for me i had my mini braids in for um, a little over four weeks and i think the next video after this i'm going to show you guys ways in which i style them so you might as well stick around for that um yeah like i was saying i love this style because you can easily apply your products you can easily moisturize your hair like basically it's not going to hinder you at all the next thing i love about mini braids is that you can style it in different ways oh my god like the styles are the possibility of different styles are endless you can style it in so many ways like i said i have a video coming up oh my goodness the things i go through just to get good angles so at this point i was like um, an hour and 30 minutes in because it took me an hour and 30 minutes to break the first the first part of the first section and yeah guys i was particularly neat i was like very particular about the parting i try to make it as neat as possible another tip is to make if you want your braids to look fuller try to do like the brick pattern don't um 
don't break do your parting let them fall uh, on straight lines i don't know if you know what i mean like that you don't want that so i had i realized that's what i was doing so i had to go back and make sure they fall on um they are the middle of the previous braid as you can see so that's going to kind of close up the the parts where you have your part and it's going to make your hair fuller yeah guys i struggled with the front part because my the 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 hair around my perimeter is quite short but i braided it still and it came out really nice i really really liked it so like i was saying this is me like three hours in i took like an hour 30 minutes on each side of the front part of my hair and yeah as you can see i was just admiring the works of my hand i had to just pack it up braid it so that it doesn't get in the way of me braiding the back and also to keep it stretched so another thing i love about mini braids is that you can wear a wig on top of it i mean like if there are some days you get bored of your mini braids you can literally throw on your wig on it and go oh guys look at that back i really tried my best to make sure the line are neat i really tried my best to make sure the lines are neat so um another thing i love about mini braids is that you don't have to worry about your hair because obviously like it's a protective style all you have to do is moisturize and you go so yeah that's one of the reasons why i love 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 mini braids and for the cons i would say i don't like mini braids because it takes like hours to install and another thing i don't like is it might look scanty if your hair is not full it might not look as uh, appealing to the eyes if you don't have thick hair but yeah if you like to add extensions you can definitely do that but i feel like doing it with your natural hair gives this this oomph you know yeah and another thing is it takes hours to undo just like it takes hours to install but at the end of the day it's actually worth it guys it's so so worth it i kept mine for um a month plus and i styled the heck out of it like, i totally enjoyed it but like with all things, some things have to come to an end. Oh my goodness. The struggle. The struggle. The arm work. You know, this is like a workout on its own. And I was just checking to make sure the parts were neat. And I used my hands, guys. I had just one mirror in front of me. And I've been braiding my hair for a while. And I think I kind of know the layout of my hair layout of my head so i just use my hands to feel the parts and i try to get them as neat as as possible oh guys look at me getting angles you braid up you braid down just to make sure the parts are as neat as possible so you know that moment when you get to the last braid and the excitement that is what I was feeling at this point. I could not just wait to be done. I could not wait to be done at all because I'd been sitting for whopping seven hours. And you know it takes longer when you are filming. You have to put like an extra hour just for your break. So yep, look at I got done at 3.03 a.m. Look at my braids looking boneless and at this point I could not just wait to get to bed. So I just packed my hair in a bun and I went straight to bed. So this is the next day guys. Ah look at that. I don't regret cutting my hair at all because look at that. It looks so so full, so so good, so so juicy. Yeah, uh, look at me serving face and all. So well. I guess we've come to the end of this video did you enjoy it if you've watched up to this point i really 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 appreciate you and 
would you be trying this style is it something you would like to try if you cannot do it yourself Ali, you can get someone to do it for you you must not do it by yourself oh look at the lines so so neat so thank you very much for watching bye